Hello everyone, we are happy that you've joined us on another video. Since Microtech has recently launched its Microtech Home mobile application, we thought it would be useful to take a brief look at it and see how we can connect to our home device using this app. This application works via neighbor discovery and once you turn on your Microtech device and connect the device's first port to your DSL modem, the device will broadcast its Wi-Fi interface. The Microtech device we're using for this tutorial is the Microtech HAP AC Square, which has a 2.4 GHz as well as a 5 GHz Wi-Fi interface. That is why we're seeing two Wi-Fi access points in our list. All Microtech devices come with a default configuration, as we talked about in earlier sessions. And based on this configuration, your device will be shown in the Wi-Fi list with a default SSID that can be identified with a partial serial number. By tapping on one of the Wi-Fi ports of this device, we will connect to our device based on its default configurations. Once we have connected, we can enter the details of that interface and by tapping on the advanced menu, we can review the network details relevant to our device, including MAC and IP addresses, as well as download and upload speeds. Now, if you launch the Microtech Home app, you will see that your intended device, now the HAP AC Square, is shown in the list of available devices. As per Microtech default settings, the username is admin and we have no password. By tapping on connect, you can easily connect to your device via the Home app. The very first prompt once you connect to your device asks you to select the country where you are located. Next, you are asked to determine your SSID name and password. The option titled Separate Network Names is used for devices like the HAP AC Square that has two wireless interfaces. In case you enable this option, you can define one SSID for each of your 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz wireless interfaces. If you keep this option off, the same SSID will be applied to both wireless interfaces and you will connect to one of the two interfaces based on different parameters such as the distance to your device, device configurations and preferences, and so on. After defining the SSID, you will be asked to set a password for your router. That is a password for the same admin username which by default does not have a password. Finally, you can review your SSID and router security and click Save to finalize your connection settings. By tapping on Save, you will be disconnected from the device since we both changed the SSID name and set a password for both the SSID and the router. Now, if we go back to the Wi-Fi list, we will find our SSID with its new title that has been secured with a password. Once we connect to our newly defined SSID and refer to the advanced menu once again, we can see that our connection now is established with the 5 GHz interface and our download and upload speeds have increased. After connecting to the SSID, we can launch the app again and by entering our device username and password, we can enter the app in order to carry out basic configurations on our home device. As you can see, you have some general information concerning your device on the app's home page. Also, if you click on the Clients menu at the bottom, you can review the active and inactive clients of your device. Clicking on your active clients will give you more detailed information regarding the connection of that client to your device. And you also have the three dots more menu in the bottom right corner that leads to different menus for basic device configurations. And finally, if you wish, you can check your device's performance by using assessment utilities and resources such as fast.com. As you can see, we ran a speed check on our HAP AC Square and got these results. Thank you very much for watching. We hope this video helps you work with your Microtech devices at home. In case of any questions, leave them in the comments or get in touch with us with your suggestions. We'll see you in our next video. Take very good care, everyone, and goodbye.